We'll now look at a third example of exploratory factor analysis and for this example you should actually try it yourself. Uh, so I'll explain what's involved uh, first of all. Uh, the data file is downloadable from here and it's called manage.sav and we'll open that up in SPSS manage.sav alright so this questionnaire consists of 11 questions uh, the labels are here and these are questions uh, about managerial skills so these are questions that have been asked to managers and you can see that they would respond uh, according to a uh, seven point scale like at scale ranging from a great extent to a very very little extent and the questions where I show confidence in my staff I let them know they're doing well I give feedback on how they're working I personally compliment them if they do outstanding work believe in setting goals and achieving them etc okay so the question is, are there some underlying dimensions of managerial skills which summarise the variance in uh, people's responses to these items? So we'll um, go to Analyse, Dimension Reduction Factor, Control A to put all these variables in. and uh, now I've clicked on descriptives univariate statistics coefficients anti-image KMO continue extraction um, for these managerial behaviors I'll use principal axis because I'm just looking at the underlying factor structure not uh, at this stage trying to develop a model for computing composite scores the scree plot We'll just run with uh, factors over one at this stage. Rotation, mm, these managerial behaviours may well be correlated. Options, sort by size, suppress, loadings below 0.2, paste, go to my syntax and run. You should actually have a go at this one yourself first, see how you go, and um, then uh, come back and look at these results with me. Um, so we see that the scores range between, they should range between 1 and 7, so most of them are uh, towards people doing them to a great extent, 1, because uh, they're lower scores. Correlations, yep, I can see uh, the, the these are at least moderate, uh, small to moderate correlations amongst the items. Um, this is over 0.5 or 0.6. Spartless is significant, and therefore we know that these um, uh, diagonals, where are they down here, are all well over 0.5. Communalities. Um, there's some items that have dropped below 0.5 so it may not be the world's uh, best factor solution but they're all over 0.4 three factors with eigenvalues above one looks like there's a drop um, between three and four so three factors or maybe two factors could work one two hmm, yeah I'll be looking at two and three factors I would say pattern matrix looks pretty good, pretty simple. Um, I let my staff know they're doing me well, compliment them, so show confidence. So this is a giving feedback, this is a time management factor, and this is about stress, um, or decision making under stress. So I actually have three good f factors and no overlap.